this uh, balloon hat, you're going to need two balloons and inflate them to about three or four inches from the end. And you want them to be fairly close, as close as you can. Even if you don't get them that close on the inflation, you still have some leeway, so don't worry about it. So anyway, let's uh, get this thing started. Go with your first balloon. Now, you have to kind of measure that this distance will be about approximately half of the diameter of a person's head. So I'll just make this for a kid, kind of on the small side here. But I'm gonna say uh, here we're going to go and make a basic twist here. Now we're gonna make a pinch twist here. Notice how I'm holding with the left hand, otherwise it would come undone. Hold, now make a small basic twist. Remember to always pinch and then twist. Makes it a lot easier. Now fold. Now this is going to turn into a pinch twist. So what you're going to do is pull this and then twist it. Let's do that. And you have half of your two balloon jester hat. Let's do the same with the other one. Now you want the second balloon to match here as close as you can, but you may have to adjust depending on the person you're making the balloon for. Again, I pinch and twist, holding with the left hand here, twisting with the right. Now we're gonna make a pinch twist. I already explained it, so I'll just go right through it. And we have two of these shapes here. Now, what you do is you take one and reverse it. And then these nozzles go into the pinch twist. Let's do that. All you do is pull the nozzle and wrap it around the pinch twist. Same with the other side. And of course, this is what goes around the person's head. And this is for a little kid. For an adult, you'll have to make this bigger. Now you take these two balloons here and you're gonna cross them on top. And then we're gonna twist these together. So it's just one basic twist right here. Let's do that. Now I like to have it something like this. So you have your hat formed here, you have your arch here, and then place these so they're uh, perpendicular going that way. I mean, I guess you could do it this way, but I think it looks better this way. Now, you can take this and kind of give it a little bend. So what you do is make, try and make sure the air doesn't escape here and just bend it. Like that. And let's do the same with the other side. Remember, you have to hold the air here, otherwise the air will come out. So hold it here and bend. And it gives it one of those kinds of things. Now we're gonna make the end of the tassel. So all you're gonna do is make a small basic twist at the end and then squeeze it to the end of the balloon. There's one. Basic twist and push it to the end. And there you have a two balloon jester hat. Of course, there is a three balloon version. It takes uh, one more balloon and a little more twisting. So you may want to use this one as a shortcut and this will be very popular at events. It's very colorful and uh, Kids as well as adults will enjoy wearing these. So that's a two balloon jester hat.